Chef Sergio, and I'm here to change your life, one plate at a time. Our next dish is going to be Eggman with a zesty dressing. We're going to have this beautiful, nice Eggman here. We're just going to cut it two tips. Just going to cut it into the, um, small pieces so ready for us to cook. And I don't want to keep, I want to keep it as still a big pieces because I want to use this one here. You can use this one as a side dishes. You can use this one here as um, um, you blend it all together. You can use this one here as a sauce. It's phenomenal. You can also add this one here on your salad. Keep it all these pieces in here. Just chop it up and put it all in a beautiful salad. What am I going to do here? Just going to put it right in here. If you do this beautiful inside here, just going to start uh, setting them down. All of them just face down. The part that you kind of want to put it on the bottom right here and then gonna start um, cooking this one here okay and when do you know when this one all ready all you need to do is just give it a quick touch see if they're nice and soft and they're good to go it's gonna take you about um, 10 to 12 minutes to completely cook it but like again I don't want to make it a too cooked because I don't want it to be too mushy so I'm gonna give it about 10 to 12 minutes cooking time just leave it over here Let's put a lid on it, let it cook in here on a lower temperature. It's okay if it clicks, then you just lower up a little bit. What I'm going to do till now, I'm going to show you how to make the dressing, the nice zesty dressing, okay? I'm going to um, put a little bit of um, chili sauce. You can do the nice spicy one, you can do the sweet one. If you wanted to sweeten it up like I'm doing, it, just add a little bit of a sugar. I'm just going to do a little bit of a soy sauce. And then just going to start adding all these beautiful vegetables in here, okay? Some chopped green onions. I'm gonna also add some um, um, celery leaves. I love the celery leaves. I love the, the crunchiness. I love the spiciness in here. And you don't have to really, really chop it fine. Just give it a roughly chop. I'm just gonna put some um, cilantro here, or commonly known as um, coriander. Again, just a rough cut in here. Um, with some fresh mint. Definitely here you can add some um, uh, basil. Any, any green stuff in here, some fresh oregano to work with this one here. I'm also going to add some lemon juice and a lemon zest right in here, all together. Just going to give it a nice, beautiful mix. This one here, just put it all together. This is going to be really, really nice and delicious. And this is what I'm going to use uh, to marinate my eggplant when it's done. Okay, just a few minutes. We're going to plate the eggplants. I'm gonna put this beautiful sauce around the top. Okay, now we have the um, cooked teflon ready to go, ready to be plated. Just gonna go right here, put it one after the other one, just layer it on the plate. It doesn't have to be one on top of the other one right here. There you go. And this is the perfect, the perfect um, texture you wanna have in your eggplant. It doesn't have to be overcooked or not too raw. There you go, just pour a little bit of this sauce right on top. There you go, like this. Perfect. And yeah, but like I said, this is gonna be great as a side dish. You can also use this one here on salads. This is also when you make a beautiful fish, you just serve it right next to it. It's gonna be a great complimentary on it.